Hey guys, I'm doing a follow-up video on the last video I did on how to repair the cigarette lighter in a Toyota Camry. Uh, in that last video I had mentioned a cigarette lighter adapter that plugs directly to the battery. So this video here is going to demonstrate how to use this adapter and give you a little bit more detail on it. Um, I got this adapter from Harbor Freight, item number 66407. And I also wanted to take this opportunity to show you guys an air compressor that I use, uh, item number 96068. Um, this combination is fairly cheap, about $30 to $35 if you get it on sale. Um, to me, it's an inexpensive and invaluable tool you should keep in each one of your cars. Here's the adapter removed from the packaging. It's fairly straightforward. You've got a negative and positive uh, clamps that go onto the battery terminals. And then you have a female socket, which uh, the appliance plugs into. And, uh, so I'll go ahead and unbox this, show you guys what this is about. A nice little carrying case. You've got your air hose, the standard connector on one end and a threaded nozzle on the other end that threads onto the valve stem of the tire. The package also contains uh, manual warranty information and uh, some adapters to fit uh, maybe a basketball or some other sports equipment. Itself, fairly simple. You've got your 12 volt cable with the cigarette lighter adapter at the end, and you've got your gauge, it goes up to 100 psi. And there's the on off switch, it's fairly small, compact, has rubber feet, metal casing. So let's go ahead and hook it up and see how it works. So here I've got the cigarette lighter adapter hooked up to the battery and clip on each terminal and uh, you can see the cord is fairly lengthy the adapter itself so pretty nice and uh, here's where the tire inflator plugs in got everything hooked up and the hose is threaded onto the valve stem so let's go ahead and crank it up and get it going about 40 psi and we're about done here so uh, that's about it pretty good combination here cheap works well not a bad idea to keep one in every car hope you enjoyed the video thanks